Hello, my name is Roger Sinison and I'm a candidate for the Board of Education in San Francisco. I have spent the majority of my life in and around the public school system. I attended San Francisco public schools myself, as did my wife, and as are my three children. There ne was never any choice for our kids other than public schools. My wife, we've been together for a total of 28 years, is a 25-year veteran public school teacher, and I have seen firsthand the challenges teachers face on a daily basis and the hard work they put in to teach our kids, especially in a low-income, high-immigrant school such as hers. I have been an active volunteer at my kids' schools as a member of the school site council on the PTSA in several roles and as a volunteer both in the classroom and in general, as well as with extracurricular activities. For nearly 15 years, I have worked closely with public school districts and county offices of education around the state as a software developer working for a company specializing in software for school districts. This has given me keen insight into the inner workings of a school district that many other candidates don't have. I want to make sure our schools provide a safe and healthy learning environment for all our students. As the son of an immigrant refugee, I am committed to working with the district and parent volunteers to ensure that newcomers and longtime San Francisco residents can participate fully and can share resources amicably. Our district is home to families and children from all over the world of all backgrounds, races, sexual orientations, and gender identities. We can be the standard bearer for diversity that goes beyond tolerance, beyond acceptance, to celebration. We must address the achievement gap affecting so many of our most vulnerable students by ensuring equity across all schools. My kids attended a school that raises over $100,000 a year. My wife's school is lucky if they can raise $5,000. I want to change that by encouraging schools to work together in a buddy system so that they can learn from each other, share contacts and techniques, and build enthusiasm amongst parents and the community. In addition, we must increase access to and exposure to STEAM subjects, technology and the arts, in the daily curriculum and as extracurricular activities. Participation in team sports is a powerful motivator for many students, but we can't forget that there are students who find the same compelling interest in drama, music, debate, and journalism, as well as technology, engineering, and other sciences. We put a lot of time and energy and money into sports programs, but not all kids are athletically inclined. We need to make sure we fully support similar programs for the artistically and scientifically inclined as well. In conclusion, thank you for your time and please vote Sinison for Board of Education this November.